Welcome back, this is Yamachak. Today we're going to do another Hell on Earth Endless run as SWAT. Not level 25 yet, but you know, it's not required for Hell on Earth. Just recommend it. You're at 20, that's good enough. Uh, I don't know this map too well either. I, I like, I don't play, I don't usually have this much variety in, uh, in the maps I play on. I, um, I tend to stay with like, a couple of maps uh, or I play on uh, servers with just whatever they want to play and uh, we don't really have to worry about like kiting because we have like a whole bunch of people whereas here I do have you know to kite And uh, that means that I need to figure out how the hell I'm gonna do that. You're not, you're not doing that to me. Don't even. I don't believe you can. Didn't I start with a double? I thought I tried to change that. I thought I changed my perks. I guess I didn't. I did change this one, but I, oh, I changed that one, not that one. Shoot. That's okay. The pistol doesn't make that much of a difference. It does make a difference, though, so... Uh, I think we're gonna have to stay with this weapon for another round, because I need... Mm, we could go for a Tommy gun, which might be a bit of an upgrade, but... I think we're just going to stick with this. Uh, should be able to handle another round or even maybe two with this, unfortunately, because it is 1100 bucks for the nail gun. Probably should have got the Tommy gun, hey? I don't know. I don't like the Tommy gun. And buying the MP5 Raz just kind of doesn't feel worth it to me. Because it's, it's not much better than this. Like, objectively speaking, it's it's not too much of an improvement. And, uh... So I'm kind of like, why bother, you know? Screw that Edar. We do have to kill some Edars for our, uh... That's kind of why I'm doing this in the first place, is for the Edars, to complete that, to kill five Edar... Which ones? I don't know. Wow, that guy just took all of our... I love the ragdoll physics sometimes. They just... They're so silly. You're gonna die. Okay. Like it or not. You... Wow, he just sped up a whole lot. I don't know if we can get up there. Oh, boy. You up, and you, you. you're not it. I'm not through it yet, bud, don't worry. Yeah, so I don't, uh, I don't kite, usually. So I don't know where I'm going. And uh, people don't usually vote for most maps so we don't end up playing some of the the less popular ones you know we get a, I played a lot of Zed landing I know my way around there um, biolapse know my way around that one I don't really like it so much because we've been playing a ton of it it's like every uh, I don't want to see at this point it feels like a total waste squeak squeak to get the um the tommy gun when we're so close i could sell it for the hm tech but it, it's i think it's only like mildly better yeah i think we're gonna have to go for i've never used the mac 10 
Yeah, I think we have to go this way. This is okay. As long as we don't, we might get a Skrig. I just, I really want to have the nail gun for wave five when we get a boss. Because uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to take out a boss on Hell on Earth as SWAT as pretty much with any other weapon. The, the nail gun does pretty good work against. It does pretty good damage. Everything else is pretty much exclusively reserved for. Trash killing. That Z time felt pretty good. Okay, we do get a scrape. Should still be okay, I think. As long as he's like right behind me right now. Whereas I hear him walking around, but I don't know where I see him, or where 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 he is. Up top. He's gonna come falling down from there. Or walking down here. I hear him. I don't know where he is. Right over here. Oh, he's like way down there. Okay. Nate him. Take out his head. Easy. This area remains mostly secure. Is Hans helping you somehow? Is this some sort of prank? It's just enough ammo for that. You know what? This is a little bit loud. I'm going to turn it down. Ooh, too loud, too loud. More like here. This sounds pretty okay. I think. I hope. I can edit it in post anyway, but like it was too loud for me and I felt like I was talking over it. This cat's back in the game. And I don't have to, but I feel like I have to. And so I end up talking and it like makes my voice sound weird. Even though it doesn't actually make any practical difference because I just go in and post and change it anyway. It messes with my brain, yo. It messes with my brain. The iron sights on this kind of sticks. I mean, it's a nail gun, so... Yeah, I don't know what you expected. <laughs> it's not really meant to be... I mean, I guess this one is designed to be shot at things to kill them, but... Like, as a nail gun, normally, it's not really its purpose, right? So I guess it wouldn't have that. You're dead. Okay. Oh, it's so... Like, the, the sounds are just... It's so good. She, I think she just hold... Did she just... Did I just, like, decapitate her and she held her head for a moment there? Hold on. Wait, did that just happen? Did I just see that? Set it ahead, people. Cause I feel like her head fell into her hands. You don't have enough money to live. Do... Uh, you're not dead. I have to, I'm gonna have to look at that in uh, in post. All right. This will be my first time killing a boss on Hell on Earth, and I fully expect to kill it because it's wave five of Endless, so we should be fine. Where you at, girl? 
We're both committed now. Coward should be like right here. Right? Should be able to pretty much just completely dust her. Basically instantly. As soon as her thing's gone, it should just melt. That's about what happened, yeah. Boy, five boss is always just pathetically easy. Yeah, yeah, moan all you want. You're dead. I killed you. I want to upgrade it. Can you go all the way up here? No, you can't. Can I go up this? Yes, I can. Do I want to be up here? Probably not. Wow, this is a lot of sirens. Is that four sirens and a scrake all just kind of chilling out together? Maybe five sirens? I can't move. Gotta remember to bash out of that. You know, I've already kind of learned this, and I'm not following it in practice. I want to get back down. It's so hectic up there, oh my god. Yeah, it was mostly sirens. I'm hoping to get the Edars killed in this. That's kind of why I'm doing it. This cat's back in the game. Can these guys like rush me when they've got their heads cut off? I feel like I've seen that before. But I also could may have not seen that before. Upgrade that. Don't go up top because I feel lost and afraid. Bobble Zeds. Bobble Zeds. Oh boy. That's not good. They don't take as much damage in their heads, do they? I don't think they do. I think their heads are easier to hit, but like not as vulnerable. Oh, it's satisfying though. It's a good thing you don't want to shoot them in the face anyway, so. There it is. Okay, let's see if we can't kill this guy. Like, he hasn't even... Okay, I guess he did take enough damage to be enraged, but... Just wasn't raging for some reason. Ah, it's so good. I guess I'm like stunning it or something, maybe? Not sure. Come on, boys. Who are you? I feel like it's a scrake. Yeah, two scrakes. And I'm out of ammo. Oh dear, I'm glad I didn't shoot him. Okay, so this is gonna be a little bit of a precise you know what? I thought you were both there. Uh, we're gonna have to hope for the best here. Hopefully, it's not too far off death.
die. Ha <laughs> ha. I do not appreciate the pop, the bobble Z. I think that's what the the weekly is right now too, right? No, it's up, up, and away. Which is kind of similar, ish, sort of. It's equally frustrating. Anyway, we're gonna do it because uh, you get five hundred thousand Vosh. Crawlers, I don't mind. I might take a lot of damage, but they're not going to kill me, so. You're out, Mike. These are the waves that, I don't know. It's kind of like, why does it exist? You know? Like, it's kind of like just a free money wave. Like, just give me the money. I'm definitely not gonna die on this wave. I'm just gonna suffer. Psychologically. Because of uh, the giant waste of time. That this wave is. I am kind of overusing the ammunition on it, but I doubt it's going to matter anyway. I want to see, um, like, replay mod for this, you know, where the Z time is, like, sped up to normal time. So you can see how, like, amazing you are. That'd be sick. That'd be so cool. I'm just imagining, like, Berserkers running at, like, super speed every now and then. And Gunslingers suddenly getting, like, a huge speed in their reloads. And commandos too, I guess. And then everybody just being like an actual god, running around, headshotting everything. Like it's nothing. It has to be some kind of like indicator that it's dead time still. Like you still see it, but it just doesn't slow it down. Like in the replay. But if it wasn't gonna be like gray, then I feel like it'd be strange. Like if it was gonna be gray and not slowing down time, that it would feel weird, coming. you know? You guys all have to die, okay? It's just, it's just how it goes. You're a husk, you have to die. Isn't it like the husks were the ones that were leading the attack on Paris or whatever? Like they were the forerunners of the Z army. I don't know. They were the guys who inflicted the most damage, killed the most people, really inflicted the most havoc in general. That's my understanding of the lore anyway. I don't know much about the lore. Oh boy. Should be some more fleshies coming at us, right? I heard more. Yeah, there you are. And some scrakes. An enraged scrake? Why are you enraged, buddy? Who made you angry? Show me on the teddy bear where you were touched. Your face with knives? Nails, rather? Well, it sounds like a you problem. Maybe you shouldn't have put your face inside the nails. Just a thought. What is this? And where is this?
That was a good round, honestly. We, we really messed them up there. So, second boss fight, the boss that I have personally... Let's get the MAC-10. I just want to use it. I want to see what it is. Okay, so they're incendiary rounds. Oh, right, I have the... I have, like, a precious skin for it, too. It's a garbage weapon, though. Hopefully it's a boss that we can kill. Hans? Maybe. You have been killing my test subjects. That is annoying. You will die now. Mm -hmm. I scared you. Don't hide. You haven't scared me, actually. I feel like this one's gonna really mess up his uh, shields. Oh yeah, it does. Like, it kinda... Hans gets... Pretty countered by uh, this, honestly, because he gets to he gets his shields, and then you get to take out his shields pretty easily. Okay, I say this, and then I'm going to get attacked by his shields. That's okay. Dusted. <laughs> what an easy fight. This gun is too good. We're going to use the MAC-10 on this round. Um, because I want to. And you can't stop me. Maybe it'll get us killed. Yeah, that, that could stop me. I saw, I saw ammo, but we don't need it. We don't need the ammo. ammo yes, we do. I want the ammo. I don't need the ammo. But why, why not? Why not just take it, you know? Okay, so you can single fire mode this one. But. Take him out. Nice and easy. Take you out. Nice and easy. Take you out. Nice and easy. Uh, we're going to switch over to the MAC-10 now. Because I want to... I want to use it. I want to see what it's like. Because everybody says that it's garbage, you know? And I'm like, I've never used it, so... Who knows how garbage it really is. And I'm going to say... Pretty garbage. It's a, it's a pretty, pretty awful weapon. It does, like, no damage. It's amazingly weak. I think it's not the weakest. I believe the MP7 that you start with is weaker. And the, um, the HM Tech SMG is also going to be weaker because that weapon is just, like, worthless. Um, but the MAC-10 is, like, not a cheap weapon. It's, it's 1100 dosh. You know? Who, who's going to pay 1100 bucks for that? It's hot garbage. Let's try and kill this thing with it, okay? okay. Didn't really work out so well. Like, it's an incendiary... It, it fires incendiary rounds, so... I guess it has uses in... Spreading... Chaos? But, like... So does the cock and burn. I forgot to set it to... Spread shot... Not that it mattered. So this weapon is garbage. It's fun. I might do some runs with it, but not on Hell on Earth. And since that's kind of what I'm doing these days. Uh, we have to skip this one, because this is a story. I used to listen to Windswept's all the time. Like, it was, like, the only art, the only artist that I would listen to at all. And, uh, I still, I still like him. Like, he's still one of my favorite, um, artists. It's just, uh, I also listen to other music now. 
Um, but back when I did, that story would always pop up and I'd have to keep skipping it and it was so frustrating. Because it was like multiple times a day that I'd be listening to the whole playlist. Because he had way fewer songs back then. Um, I like the Chris. Um, this used to be a medic weapon, I think, in KF1, right? Here we go. Uh, so I'd have to keep skipping it, and it was... It was so frustrating to have to keep doing that. I never ended up making my own playlist for it that just didn't include it. I really should have, considering how much it annoyed me to have to keep skipping it. But nowadays I look back on it kind of long, not longingly, but I reminisce on those times. Like just having to skip it there was, uh, we, we're, we're, we're gonna die. Nope, we got Zed time at the exact right time to save our ass. Your history. I should be using my grenades more, I guess, maybe, but I don't know. I don't really spam grenades all that often. They just, I the feel game. like there's almost always a better thing to do than shoot your than throw a grenade. Okay, we got a real... In this case, though, I am going to go for... I was going to try, but didn't end up needing it. Again, I don't know how long we're going to go for. I don't really want to go for too, too long here, so... We'll see. sister's messaging me. Okay. Here's a weapon. It's very professional. The Zeds will be there soon very professional. To alleviate your suffering. You can't stand on the... Oh, it's a... <laughs> I thought it was like a, a decoration in there for some reason, but no, it's just it's the table upside down. You fool! Miwa. Le Miwa. Miwa. Gotcha. <laughs> that, like, harmonic chainsaw is just hilarious to me. This is also, like, always an easy wave on, um... It's a more fun wave because at least you have, like to kill big zeds and you have to actually like kill them you can't just like stand there and shoot every so often to finish off the crawlers but like pretty much any class can take on a scrape any perk so it doesn't matter what perk you're playing as on endless you get the scrape wave and just again free money pretty much all of the uh, like specific zed is kind of easy because you know what to expect, you know? You know that there's going to be a siren around the corner. You know there's going to be a scrake. You know you're not going to be surprised by um, like crawlers popping up out of the woodwork or something like that. Like it's, it's all one thing, so you know that that's what you're fighting and you're prepared for it. Whereas normally, you know, you can't really prepare for absolutely everything. Like, I'm aware that there's going to be stuff everywhere, but... You know, never in a Siren Wave or a Stalker Wave are you going to fight a Flesh Pound. Right? You're never going to be dealing with a bunch of Stalkers and then a Flesh Pound pops up on you. So it just kind of makes it easier. The Edars, I believe, can still spawn, though, on the, uh, the individuals, because they spawn as a different Zed type, I think. Something like that. Right? Oh, you are a little... 
jerk. We're gonna die. This is it. Nope. I think I think I've got it handled. I think I've got it handled. I think I've got this handled. I think we'll be okay. Yeah, seems okay. This thing just does so much damage. For some reason, the one as the Berserker just doesn't kill Flesh Pounds as well. Like, I read, um... Berserker guys, whatever, and they say that the... Where are you? They say that the Vlad nail gun should be... Um, shredding Flesh Pounds, but for some reason, it just doesn't for me. I don't know, maybe I'm bad at aiming with it. Or... It's weirder to aim with than I think it is. I don't know. Uh, my guess is uh, this is the one where we're going to die. I haven't killed a boss before. And this one I just did two. I mean, the first one doesn't really count. What's the chances that we get another kill, right? Probably not that high, is my guess. That's it. Should be. We're not alone. I have nowhere that I can hide from that one. Oh, you're still doing your thing. Hopefully we can kill her because that would be very nice to get a kill on this. I'm ex expecting that once that thing is gone, we should be able to handle this pretty well. So I'm going to try and take out the... Uh, we're out of ammunition. Chances of winning at this point? Honestly, not really that high. Take her out with the Chris. Why can't I move? Try some grenade spam, see if we can stun her. No. Yeah, that's about what I expected. We almost had it, but... Uh, ran out of ammo. I shouldn't have gone for the... I, I should have just gone for her face after I got rid of the cap. I thought I had more ammo than I, uh, than I did. It's okay, though. Wasn't a bad Hell on Earth run. Not too shabby. You almost got a new head popper. I wanna I really wanna get like an absurd amount of headshots in one um thingy mo bobber. But not this time. Anyway, that'll do it for this video, so thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Bye bye.